Hello and welcome to the news from Bahrain International. I'm Samar Ajawi. His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa followed the Children Endurance Race with the participation of the representative of His Majesty the King for Humanitarian Work and Youth Affairs, His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa and his children. The race was held as part of the festival of the first deputy chairman of the Supreme Council for Youth and Sport, President of the General Sport Authority and President of Bahrain Olympic Committee, His Highness Sheikh Khalid bin Hamad Al Khalifa. The festival is being organized by the Bahrain Royal Equestrian and Endurance Federation from the 6th to the 8th of January. His Majesty the King followed the leadership of His Highness Sheikh Nasser with the participation of His Highness Sheikh Nasser's children, Sheikh Shayma bint Nasser bint Hamad Al Khalifa, Sheikh Hamad bin Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa, and Sheikh Mohammed bin Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa. The race saw the participation of many jockeys from various local stables and was followed by Sheikh Hamdan bin Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa. His Majesty the King praised the prominent role of His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa in preserving the kingdom's equestrian sports heritage and developing it. He affirmed the steady development of the equestrian sport in Bahrain, which earned the kingdom many achievements. His Majesty the King stressed the role of the endurance races in boosting confidence in the youngsters, praising His Highness Sheikh Nasser's far-sighted vision and providing the ideal climate for the children to take up the equestrian sports, particularly the endurance one. His Majesty the King lauded the efforts of brief President Sheikh Isa bin Abdullah Al Khalifa and the Federation members and committees to ensure the best organization of the endurance championships, wishing all participants every success in future races. The representative of His Majesty the King for Humanitarian Work and Youth Affairs, Honorary President of the Royal Equestrian and Endurance Federation, His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa, led with His Highness's children the 40-kilometer endurance race at the festival of the first Deputy Chairman of the Supreme Council for Youth and Sport, President of the General Sport Authority and President of Bahrain Olympic Committee, His Highness Sheikh Khalid bin Hamad Al Khalifa organized by the Royal Equestrian and Endurance Federation from 6 to 8th of January. In the presence of the President of the Royal Federation, His Highness Sheikh Isa bin Abdullah Al Khalifa. His Highness Sheikh Nasser was keen to direct the children of His Highness, Her Highness Sheikh Shayma bin Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa, His Highness Sheikh Hamad bin Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa, and His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa and following up on His Highness Sheikh Hamdan bin Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa and with the participation of a number of young jockeys from various local stables. His Highness Sheikh Nasser stressed that several gains and goals have been achieved from the horse race, foremost of ingraining confidence in children, allowing them to acquire new skills and talent in horse riding and adapting to different climatic challenges during endurance races. 
His Highness indicated that he is keen to support the children in order to continue their participation in endurance races. And at the end of the race, His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa honored his children and all the participants in the race. سمو الشيخ ناصر فرحه كبيره عشناها اليوم في الواقع في هذا المهرجان الانجال وقيادتك لهم في رؤيه واقعيه لكيفيه تعامل الاب مع انجاله. يعني في البدايه الحقيقه هذا كان حلمي يراودني من يوم ما بديت اركب بطولات القدره والتحمل انه يعني متى بيجي اليوم ان شاء الله لأشوف اشوف عيالي اولا والعين بالخيل. وثانيا يشاركوننا هذه المسيره واليوم الحمد لله يتاهلون اول تاهيلي يعني فعلي لهم العام كان تشجيعي واليوم تاهيلي وبكل مراحله والحمد لله خلصوا هذا التاهيلي والجزء الاكبر من هذا النجاح ومن تحقيق هذا الحلم طبعا وجود وتدعم وتشجيع المتواصل من سيدي حضره صاحب الجلاله الله طول عمره طول العمر هل هذه تباشير وبشاره الى الانجال جميعا ان في المستقبل راح نشاهد بطوله على كاس سمو الشيخ ناصر للانجال ان شاء الله ما في شك ما في شك هم ان شاء الله على هذا النهج وعلى هذا المطاف ونعودهم على المنافسه واحتمال الخساره وفرص الفوز فلازم يتعودون على هذه المشقه ترى انتم تشوفونهم اليوم خلصوا 40 لكن ما تعرفون كل يوم ايش كانوا يسوون في الاسطبل كل يوم كانوا يتدربون وكانوا يعني يتحملون وصارت عندهم نوع من التنافس وصار بينهم بين نفسهم يعني طموح فكل هذه الخطوات تبني بطل في المستقبل يتحمل ويواجه ويتقبل ايضا كل الظروف اللي يواجهها طول العمر متابعه سيدي جلاله الملك للفرسان لكم الله يسلمك هي رساله واضحه بان كل انسان معطاء وصاحب عطاء في هذا البلد له تقدير ما في شك ما في شك هو الداعم الاول والاخير لطول عمره حتى اليوم موجوده ويانا نشطنا زود تنشطت حتى خيلنا فنحن يعني الحقيقه شاكرين وعاجزين عن وصف مشاعرنا تجاه سيدي حضره صاحب جلاله لان انا واحد احد مشاريعه فما بالك ترى بعد احفاده وترى ابناء وبنات مملكه البحرين فالله يطول عمره يعني هو الاول والاخير طول العمر السبق القادم كسيدي جلاله الملك واستعدادات وما احب يقول سمو الشيخ ناصر بهذه المناسبه كاس الملك اغلى الكؤوس عندنا نستعد لها بكل ما استطعنا من قوه خيلنا جاهز ان شاء الله ونفحمها ونجهزها ونتقبل المنافسه ان شاء الله لو كانت في منافسه خارجيه بنرحب بها وان ما كانت منافسه خارجيه فاحنا ان شاء الله بيننا وبين بعض ان شاء الله بنادي افضل ما عندنا هذا كاس غالي واحنا جاهزين له ان شاء الله Under the directives and follow-up of the representative of His Majesty the King for Humanitarian Work and Youth Affairs, Honorary President of the Royal Equestrian and Endurance Federation, His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa, and under the patronage of First Deputy Chairman of the Supreme Council for Youth and Sports, 
President of the General Sports Authority and President of the Bahrain Olympic Committee, His Highness Sheikh Khaled bin Hamad Al Khalifa. The activities of His Highness Sheikh Khaled bin Hamad Al Khalifa Endurance Festival continued, organized by the Royal Equestrian and Endurance Federation during the period from the 6th to the 8th of January. The Bahrain International Endurance Village witnessed a large participation in the 40 and 80 kilometer local qualifying races, where participation reached 93 horsemen from various stables. His Highness Sheikh Nasser stressed that the championship of His Highness Sheikh Khalid bin Hamad Al Khalifa is one of the great tournaments organized by the Federation and enjoys great interest from stables and jockeys and always witnesses open competition in various races. His Highness noted the great development witnessed in this championship in the current season which has increased excitement that shall continue in the 120 kilometer race for private stables. His Highness expressed his appreciation for the efforts of the Royal Federation headed by His Highness Sheikh Isa bin Abdullah Al Khalifa to bring out the championship at the best organizational level. His Highness Sheikh Nasser explained that the wide participation in the races confirms the successful march of the endurance sport in the kingdom and the distinguished turnout of stables and jockeys and the prominent presence in the tournaments organized by the Royal Federation. His Highness Sheikh Nasser wished success to all the participants in the 120 kilometer race, expecting the race to witness high speeds and open competition among all. The village will be on a date with hosting the 120 kilometer race for private stables, which will witness wide, wide participation after the veterinary examinations. Kuwait National Assembly Speaker Marzouk Ali Al Ghanem hailed Bahrain's development achievements led by His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa. This came as he received the Arab Parliament Speaker Adel Al Asumi on the sideline of his current visit to the state of Kuwait. He commended Bahrain's strides and diplomacy which contributed to enhancing the kingdom's standing in the Arab regional and international arenas and bolstering its relations and role in supporting pan-Arab action and maintaining regional security and stability. Al Ghanem described Bahrain as a role model for political, economic and social progress, hailing its achievements over the past years in the prosperous era of His Majesty the King. The two sides discussed key Arab issues and ways of unifying the stances in international parliamentary platforms to strengthen cooperation. The national vaccination campaign continues to witness a wide turnout of citizens and residents. The Ministry of Health announced that a total of 1,205,953 had taken the first dose of the vaccine, while 1,181,661 had taken the second dose and 873,930 took the booster dose. The ministry renewed its call for the community to commit to all precautionary measures and take the initiative to register for the coronavirus vaccination. And the Ministry of Health said today that the number of active coronavirus cases reached 7,807 with 313 recoveries, 1,419 registered new cases and no deaths. There are 16 active cases receiving treatment and two are in critical condition. Bahrain has recorded 1,395 total deaths, while 278,737 have recovered from the virus. The ministry urges everyone to comply with the guidelines issued by the National Task Force for Combating the Coronavirus.